Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Zagaro. You know, I made one. I made two videos of this guy making st the games and stuff out of candy. And he just released a new one. That's that's backward Let's see if he made any others besides this one. Brr. Yeah, so this is the, the only video we're gonna watch today. My dad is in a prison. And it'll be in with you. Oh, no, that's Absolutely not. not. Oh, B U B B L E S. B U B B L E S. I made entities from the back rooms out of candy. First up, I'll make a smiler. They're really happy to see you. They probably just want to pose for a family photo. Some people think they have bodies hidden in the darkness, but I'm pretty sure they're just eyes and teeth. I made this one by starting with the eyes, which will be white chocolate circles. I got some gummy teeth and cut off the gums to get regular- Okay, hold on guys. Oh, if you don't know where I am right now, I'm in my gaming setup. Oh, yeah. Before we keep going, I just want to tell you, I actually made two shorts on my first channel and my 2.0 channel. Subscribe to that channel. Where, where, um, I, um, where I made a Roblox group. And if you're subscribed and you search Zygro on YouTube and groups, then I'm a, I'm, I'll, I'll add you. Oh, yeah, you also have to do a test. If you pass it, then the request will go. So let's keep going. I pose it into a smile, and there, a smiler. That looks like the smile the Joker yeah. has in, like, every Batman movie. <laughs> Next up is the Hound, a humanoid entity that crawls around on the floor like a dog. To make this, instead of using human candy, I'll use dog candy. These treats. I got this packet of bone-shaped candies and arranged them into a hound shape. Kind of. Yummy! Can't wait to eat this! I'm gonna give some to the first dog I meet. Hello, good sir! Please accept this humble gift. No way, I am not the food! The bacteria is an entity without a proper name. We call it that because... Actually, I don't know. I guess it looks like it grew in a petri dish? Anyway, it's black and has wiry limbs, and I bet it would be disgusting to eat. That's right, I'm gonna make it out of the most disgusting candy possible. Licorice. A bunch of licorice pieces strung together make its body and limbs. Its head is kind of rectangular, oh, but definitely had. has a mouth. Hmm. So I got these two pieces of licorice yeah. and stuck them together and then put it on top to make the head. Yeah, that looks like a bacteria, I guess. Up next is the death moth, what? an oversized insect that flies around the back rooms. Why is it called a death moth, I wonder? It couldn't possibly be bad to go close to, right? Ah! To make the death moth out of candy, I will get a chocolate chip cookie. I cut it up and repositioned the pieces to be mothy. I'll stick gumballs on his eyes. Wait, they don't stick on their own? I chewed up another gumball and used that to stick these two on. There, it's the mother of all treats. I'm sorry, I couldn't think of a good joke, so that's what we're going with. Facelings are next. Mm -hmm. They look like regular people, but they have no face. The reason? They saw me, and they knew they could never be as handsome as me, so they removed their faces. <laughs> I'll start by taking some regular candy, Wait, gummy bears, sigma, and cutting maybe? off their faces. Wait, now they are faceling gummy bears. The They're also really small. Skin stealers. These guys walk around pretending to be other people, then reveal that they were wearing your friend's skin. Actually, that skin looks kind of dry. They could do with some moisturizer. I thought something was weird when I had two friends. I don't have that many friends. <laughs> In their real form, skin stealers have big mouths that go down instead of side to side. The smilers would be disappointed. To make this form of the skin stealer out of candy, I shaped some caramel fudge into the right Bruh. shape and then cut a line down the middle and put white chocolate pieces in as teeth. I made its eyes out of two small pieces of chocolate. Yeah, they're a bit bigger than they should be, but luckily I don't care! Next up are the party goers. These guys wander around looking for people to eat. I mean, people to invite to their birthday party. They're shaped like weird paper bags, but they also carry balloons. Since they're the life of the party, I will make them out of the candy served at every one of my birthday parties. Granola bars! Everyone loved going to my birthday parties when 
when I was growing up. They just always happened to be sick on my birthday and so couldn't make it to my party. I had to eat all the granola bars alone. Anyway, I will use some strawberry sauce to draw its eyes and mouth on top of the granola bar. And then I'll use this red lollipop as its balloon. Don't! Shrek is a well-known entity from the backrooms. He doesn't like it when you're in his swamp. What? You don't think Shrek is a backrooms entity? Here's some video Wait. evidence. Shrek is not- Anyway, I couldn't afford- Was Shrek really- Did Shrek really just twerk? Shrek just twerked. My guy. Hey, that's a video. That's not real. Shrek's not really in the back rooms. To buy the real Shrek candy, so I had to make my own. To do that, I got this green candy, which is shaped like a frog, and then cut some parts off to make it shaped more like Shrek's head. I used some candy eyes to finish the look. Wow, looking at this makes me feel like an all-star. Getting my game on and going to play. The last entity I will make is the Bone Thief. One look at those cute yeah, eyes and all your bones. Why did you make them less? Because he was literally in the front of the... He was literally in... In the thumbnail of the game of the of They're the gone. Video. They belong to the bone thief now. You're boneless. I'll make the bone thief by baking a cake. Since it's a yellow entity, I'll add some yellow food coloring to the cake mix to make it right yellow. Then I baked it. Hmm, the yellow's gone. I'll cut it into the right shape. Oh, the yellow's on the inside. Okay, so I use some yellow icing to cover it up and make it yellow again. I used black icing to make the mouth of the costume and then put his eyes in there. Then I added a piece of blue icing to make the tears on the side of the costume. A single piece of chocolate to make the fake eye. Oh, it fell in. Another piece of chocolate to make the fake eye. Moving on. This cake will be a real bone man's eye. I'm sorry, I've forgotten how to be funny and this is how I'm coping. There, all the important entities made out of candy. I'm not making every entity in the back rooms because there's like a million of them. Now it's time to eat them. My favorite backrooms entity is Figure from Doors. I made merch. I made shirts with Figure from Doors chasing me to commemorate the 50th time it killed me. Okay, make sure to eat the subscribe button on your way out. Thanks to all my members. Become a member to support the channel and give me money. In this video, I'm going to be hitting 100 different trick shots and stunts using Lego, so let the challenge begin. Let's start with basketball trick shots. I bought this $100 Lego.